Hey everybody, it's your friend Mateo. Remember me? I haven't made a video in what feels like forever. I can't even tell you the last video I made. It probably had something to do with um, Yerba Mate or traveling. Um, but I'm making this video especially for you, um, my 558 subscribers who have been rocking with me since um, almost a decade. Honestly, over a decade by a little bit. March 29th is when I started this um, YouTube channel. And I know it's gone through so many names. It used to be called Hard Fluff. Um, I think it used to be called Swag Poppy. And now you might notice it's called Mateo Writes because your boy has written a book, uh, a legitimate, real book that's going to be in bookstores um, all across North America for sure and hopefully in the future um, in some other countries as well. First off, I want to thank you um, for all of the people, again, who have been watching me throughout the years. Um, it felt like we really had a community here for a long time, whether um, we were discussing things around philosophy and, you know, when I was really figuring out um, who I was, um, what interested me and what I wanted to represent. In fact, I'm still figuring a lot of that out, but I was making videos all the time, right, 10 years ago, and many of you were encouraging, many of you would get into discussions with myself or others in the comments, and I really enjoyed that, and I even, I even do miss it. Um, I know that after that, you know, I was posting a lot of travel videos. I was doing those uh, edited videos, whether it was me, you know, on top of a bus in Nepal or um, exploring India, Tajikistan, any of those places. Um, many of you, you know, hundreds of you have been with me throughout that journey and I, I, I thank you. Uh, I express my deepest gratitude for um, having been able to interact with you or having you consume my content. Um, and give me words of encouragement and support throughout the way. Um, some of you back in the day would say, hey man, you're gonna write a book? Feels like you should write a book or like you wanna write a book or, any, or something like that. And I actually did. Um, where I am in life right now is I'm a writer, soon to be a published author. Um, over the past, I'd say two years, I've published a bunch of essays. Um, I wrote uh, a few books, two that I ended up throwing out and then a third that um, got me an agent and then eventually a book deal and some of the other things that I'll announce uh, down the line. That book is called Black Buck. Black Buck is a book that I started in 2018 when I hit an extremely low point in this whole journey of trying to be uh, a writer um, beyond you know the blog posts and things I used to write even though there's, there's nothing wrong with that and those are all legitimate. But I was pursuing this dream of being a published author uh, of writing fiction and after many failures some of which I'll go into at another time I wrote this book Black Buck which feels like the truest thing that I've ever written and um, will be coming out it will be published by a publisher in New York City called Houghton Mifflin Harcourt um, Houghton Mifflin Harcourt excuse me uh, it'll be out January 19th 2021 so a little less than seven months from now um, and I'm just so excited to be able to share this with the world. Um, this book, well, you know, instead of me just being off the cuff, let me read the back. And this right here, this is uh, an advanced copy. Um, other advanced copies will be printed in the future and people will be able to win them a variety of different ways. And I'll tell you more about that in a second. Um, but to read the back of this book, for fans of Sorry to Bother You and The Wolf of Wall Street, a blazing satirical debut novel about a young man given a shot at stardom as the lone black salesman at a mysterious, cult-like, and wildly successful startup where nothing is as it seems. There's nothing like a black salesman on a mission. An unambitious 22-year-old, Darren, lives in bed -Stuy. Whoa. Punctuation's off. Let me, you know, we'll keep it real. If you guys remember these videos, I'd mess up sometimes. Just keep it going. An unambitious 22-year-old, Darren, lives in a bedside brownstone with his mother, who wants nothing more than to see him live up to his potential as the valedictorian of Bronx Science. But Darren is content working at Starbucks in the lobby of a midtown office building, hanging out with his girlfriend, Soraya, and eating his mother's home-cooked meals. All that changes when a chance encounter with Rhett Daniels, the silver-tongued CEO of Someone, NYC's hottest tech startup, results in an exclusive invitation for Darren to join an elite sales team on the 36th floor. After enduring a hell week of training, Darren, the only black person in the company, reimagines himself as Buck, a ruthless salesman unrecognizable to his friends and family. 
But when things turn tragic at home and Buck feels he's hit rock bottom, he begins to hatch a plan to help young people of color infiltrate America's sales force, setting off a chain of events that forever changes the game. Black Buck is a hilarious, razor-sharp skewering of America's workforce. It is a propulsive, crackling debut that explores ambition and race and makes way for a necessary new vision of the American dream. So yeah, that's what it says on the back. Um, if that sounds interesting to you, great. Um, if you'd like to pre-order it, you can go to buyblackbuck.com. On that site, there's a little bit more information about the book, more information about me, um, different links to pre-order the book from. You can pre-order from uh, Barnes & Noble, Amazon, or your local bookstore, uh, potentially. Um, definitely in the next couple of months if you live in the States. And I'm just really excited to be at this next uh, step of my journey and hopefully have a, long, a lot of you along with me and hopefully you know, having earned your support or earning your support along the way. Um, if you go to buyblackbuck.com, you're also going to see a uh, form at the bottom where you can just sign up with your email address and join my newsletter. I have been sending out one newsletter a month for the past two months. I actually sent out the uh, most recent installment yesterday. And um, yeah, let's keep in touch. I mean, there's a lot of exciting things going on. And um, if you've been rocking with me for years and we used to talk, please drop a comment. If we haven't and you're just seeing this video or a friend shared it with you, um, you know, I'd love to hear what you think about what I just described in terms of the book. Um, if you want to check out some more of my other writing, I will drop a link in the description as well. Um, a lot of my other writing is at mateowrites.com slash writing. Uh, where I have links to essays and other things that I've published. Other than that, I'm wishing all of you extremely well. Um, I know that we're still in a pandemic or we're coming out of it. I hope that you and your families are healthy, um, sane, and as happy as can be, especially with everything else going on in the world and you know all of the recent murders and executions um, of unarmed people in America. Um, but to end this on a positive note, again, I thank you. I express my deepest gratitude for you being along on this journey. Um, I hope to be able to do these videos more and connect with you all in that way. Um, but yeah, shoot me a message. I'll leave my email address at the bottom and I look forward to hearing back from all of you and hopefully some of you uh, supporting and enjoying Black Buck. Also, I do still drink mate. I actually have some on my desk uh, right over there. Thank you everybody, have a great day.